terms of the round robin. Sorry, not best of ones, obviously best of threes. But then it feels like other times they kind of just play at the level of their opponent and they just fist fight and scrap. So I guess we're going to have to see whether or not we're getting the waiver that we saw against NIP on the weekend where it was literally... It's a double range bottom lane. Renata can really struggle. Yeah, she really can. I think this mid lane play might end up happening. Flash forward. Flash for Flash. Are they actually going to go for dive here? No, cast a wide on the queue. As his uh, safeguard to Ooh, protect uh, his mid laner is hung. An aggressive flash in there. Shaohu surviving as Carson just takes him down. Hung. I mean, he saw the play. Oh, 100 damage off. Oh, boy. And Carson, look at him. Look at the camera. On the camera as the <laughs> pause comes out. He's like, yeah, I'm sure he's a bug, bro. And himself, this uh, dragon cast up. Just returning to farming. So WE went out as is kind of by design of the champions in the draft, but speaking of, the shove is now bringing multiple members of WE down here. Light, not gonna be forced to use anything, but Crisp is in trouble. And he's- Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Crisp yeah, is and he's more got... than just trouble, my goodness. No, when you don't have cooldowns, you commit to a trading river, he will chase you forever to continue to harass you down. Carter, uh -oh. looking for Shanks here. Not gonna go for the combo though. Oh, oh Chris looks in Chris. trouble. Oh, but Xiaohu with a double Tibbers to answer it. I want you to target. Carson goes in. Oh. Doesn't even have to use his ultimate. Light trying to finish the job, but he's too late to the play. Xiaohu down now. As Carson back in. Dragon's Rage was used, actually, in fact. As Hung tries to get over the wall, but denied by Chris. A bit of revenge for the play earlier in the bottom lane. Yeah, so WE kicked that in. So WE, as you're calling out, this is... Not a good sequence here. This tower's not going to drop, but I mean, look at its HP. It's as good as dead. The Shy is going to get 600 extra of UV winning where he can. Yeah, this is uh, a beautiful game from the Shy, and he's got a full. He's on two items in 16. The Shy who drops the Tim's trying to clear the way. He is going to be dope here. As Chris comes in with the hostile takeover, but I don't think that's enough. Shy who goes down, hung with a nice little kill there. And a good punish from WE to catch just an attempt to collapse onto the Shy, but he gnaws out in time. Doesn't die. That's what happens. As speaking of collapses, Xiaohu has flash, so he should be okay. He managed to cast his all anyway. Must have just been a, a single frame where he was mashing R together. That's going to time out. That's a bit of a big time of WE to work with. And honestly, this is going to be the only opportunity maybe that they get to start this one up. So it's a 50 50, but it's one they have to take. Xiaohu's behind. I want to. He's going to be one shot there by the other team. Oh, uh, they get the Baron, but by the end of it, they're like lands the swords out. I guess at the very least, if we're, you know, silver linings and all that good stuff, the Baron's off the map. That can't be taken by Weibo for a massive snowball for the next couple of minutes. But they've okay, gone back. He's just oh, oh, no, he oh, can't oh, 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 ah. This play is lasting forever. <laughs> Nobody's doing anything. The <laughs> Shag is still in the rush. <laughs> <laughs> he's been there for years at this point. Have you seen the film Seven Years in Tibet? Well, We've got Shang seven years in the bot lane He's brush. still here. They're moving towards him. Da -da -da. Nobody's going to him. Surely. Da -da -da. Surely this is it now. Shang. Da -da -da. There's the cover. <laughs> Let's go, Shang. It was all worth it in the end. Dude. I am loving this from WE. They're basically saying, look, we can't win fight. Let's just pull out some shenanigans. Oh. Hung drops a ward in the pit. <laughs> TP going to come off through. So it's 1v1 one between our top laners in the meantime. Xiaohu joins the fray. Has Tibbers. Has stun. Oh, in fact, no. Tibbers is already out. Yeah. Has the stun available, though. The Shy almost solo killing view view. He's going for an in hit while all this is going on. Weibo are happy to just keep this going. Baron will reset. But uh, when he's in mini, he just kind of wins. And at three items, too tanky for you to deal with. Now there's a collapse here. Oh, and that's a the kick comes out. I won the one shot here. Oh, Home to a chemical. Can he survive? The GA keeps him alive. Who needs drugs? It's two kills for the side one. WE on the back foot and have been for a while. Weibo, I don't know if they can necessarily end, but they can certainly try to as the shy forcing away his GA alive. But.
still alive. That's the important part. Doesn't go for a shutdown. Doesn't ruin the perfect KD. And Baron, two minutes. Sinks up nicely. Oh, the stopwatch stopped the engagement. Will it be enough, man? It can be. It's back for the Muslim team. It's a one for one here, but the Shy's arrived. Turns it into two. And there's a third one as well in the GA, just waiting to be taken. The Shanks is chased out by Casa. The jungle's not meant to win the 1v1, but the Sonic wave to land the triple kill. It's unofficial, but we'll take those. Casa 5 0 and 7. There's Weibo, will waltz this one towards the Nexus. Excellent game from the Weibo jungler, an excellent game from Weibo as a whole. We asked the question, coming into the series, what version of Weibo are we getting today? Are we getting the one that plays the level of their team that they're against? Or are we getting the Weibo that just smashes their the, uh, the opponent pretty much at their own whim, and it feels like it's been the loud. And WE, they'll drop 0-1 in the series, Weibo pick up the first game, and Weibo just to deal with. WE about a rise. I think out of the things they've hovered so far, this will maybe make the most sense. Can stand this own two feet the most against uh, this duo, and they will lock it in. Plus, it sets up for Hung in the early stage of the Lee Sin. The Rune Prison into the Sonic Wave. Really, really consistent Ooh. healing capabilities than the Nami does. And now, Blood is in the water, and WE, they're eyeing yeah. up a dive. And it's just going to happen to be two! <laughs> Doesn't even need the jungle. A TP channeled from Xiaohu as well. And they still lose the play. That is huge from That's all it was as uh, BBU kind of messing up the opportunity to try and get the kill on the Shy. Had the jungle nearby, but Shy now just infinite advantage in the top side. Has his ultimate. If he could find the stun, this could be a kill from the Shy. Flashes in and punishes the fumble. BBU. Not having a good game. Do you know what would have helped you view there <laughs> in that 1v1? <laughs> Having his flash. <laughs> Why did he flash? Oh, man? I'm so confused. All right, Hung. Okay, so he's got the angle for the kick. So the Shy should be dead. But how should, long will it take? Could. He uses the lightning rush. Uh, he noticed Casa is actually just doing his blue buff. He's not even coming to try and help. He's like the shy. If you can escape this one, fair play to you, but I ain't helping. You're on your own, yeah. buddy. No, nope, you're gone. And, uh, yeah, yeah, Hung is really low. Uh -oh. lands, I mean, ult is available. This is just yeah. gonna be a kill for Casa. <laughs> the Herald bashing Hung as well. The shy who moves over. It's not even needed. A solo kill in the jungle. <laughs> oh, hello. Flash Bad. forced in the bottom side. Can it be answered? All surveillance building, so. Just wanted to make sure that that kill was absolutely guaranteed. Not to be deterred. Still gonna go for it. Loses half his HP. Needs to find the knockback. And all out comes on through. The oh, Shy. No. He does damage now that the all out's in play. Walks away. Still has HP. The knockback oh. doesn't land. Oh! Walks into melee range. And the whirling death. Too little, too late. <laughs> Man, but you never know, do you? You never know. Oh my god! Get the kick it's so cool, but Hunk can't finish the kill. Crisp is just 1v1. He doesn't go on the end of Dragon Fit. Shanks moves Shanks over. Helping. Crisp still surviving as the rest of the gang arrives. Shanks is going to be the one to go down. Crisp finally falls as Castle low on HP as well, but a double knockback. And Xiaohu follows up. It's going to be a triple kill. A third of the nine tail fox. Not bad at all. I think that's enough for both teams to decide this ain't worth it anymore. Yeah, I'm not gonna go for a full commit either side here. As I say that though, Hung has the kick and it's a flash. Oh, it's a kick. The ultimate comes straight out to Hung though. He doesn't have the help to keep this one going. Shanks charging oh, forwards, tied away across the team. Shanks threatening on to Xiaohu, whose charm should be up soon, but Cast is down. There's the charm underneath the tower. Ever Frost 2, but not quite in tower range. Yeah, the first part of the skirmish, and like you say, the bot lane moving. Wins him the fight. Tra tower taken off the back of it as well. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Exactly. So, um, they, um, uh, um, he's got those axes spinning. WE, though, burning through this straight for the time being. 5k on at 6k, in fact. It's Kasa trying to move in. A TP behind enemy lines from Bu Bu Weibo are committed, though. The Shy not here. No TP. This is 4v5. The cast is caught out, stunned up, and taken down. Light trying to escape with his life, but hope. Oh! Here's the, the Shy arriving on the scene. Late is better than never. But Xiaohu doesn't have to damage up at all. It's only the singular kill. And now Xiaohu being chased. Spirit Rush available, but just not used. 
And now the shy in a 1v1 with Biu Biu taken out and WE. They find everything they could have wanted. A little bit awkward, but they're still the ones on the map. As Xiaohu and the shy are the ones that end up dying and they'll get the dragon. So all is well, all is well that ends well. And we'll see how they can start here at this stage in the game. Is a bit of a powerhouse. Damage almost returned in kind to be fair, but not enough oh. to find lethal. Oh. Uh, uh, speaking of returning, bring it back. Uh, it's going to be Shanks taken out in the top side. A nice little pick for Weibo. No idea how it happened. Maybe spotted on a ward. We'll just go for a reset. As the Shy gets a Herald in the top lane. That's going to be one dead tier two. Yeah, I Slicing Maelstrom like that last team fight. They should be yeah. very, very stop the Shy from just finding oh. another way back in. As here we go. Hope getting a gate on. trouble. The Chops, I mean, he's gone. And there's the Adder. Stacks we talked about, like games for teams. Like, yeah, it's such a close run this year. Bu Bu trying to threaten on the bottom side of the play. This should be enough for the dragon to be taken unless Casa goes for it, jumps in half of Fang's health. Dragon taking the Shahu. One HP and Bu Bu finishes the job. Now all out onto the shy. Forget Ken and ultimate. It's never even gonna get to use it. Hope shuts him down with the gale force. And now Casa on the front line. Whirling death. It does some damage, but not enough. And it's only the bottom lane from Weibo remaining. WE, a huge moment in the game. Found enough space to secure the dragon and shout who gets chunked out from the exchange itself. Give you cleans up that mess. Those opportunities. Trying to hover for Shanks right now. Shadow this top side for Xiaohu. He reckons he's found that mistake. Diving in onto Iwandi. The Sona surviving though the shield not taken down in the end. And now the return from WE. But Hope caught by the shot all out to protect the AD carry. Carter jumps onto the back line as well. Hope down. But look at Weibo's health bars. They're taken apart. Carter with a double, but it just doesn't matter. Shanks carrying the fight. And TP's into the base. WE want to end. WE, I don't know if they've got enough damage to end though. They might have the time on their side. I think it's just going to be an inhibitor munch. But like you say, Shanks carries the team fight. Kasa full sends it all the way to the back line for Iwandi. And even though Xiaohu's able to follow up, after that, they're behind enemy lines and the Shai does his best to try and follow up on some more diving antics. But if no one's killing Shanks, it doesn't really matter. He's going to slowly but surely mow through the health bars in the long run. And again, it feels like in this kind of death pool composition. On the map, but could find themselves back in this game. Draven certainly scales well as we've got a fight up in the top side. A kick from Hung here. And already a pick on to Xiaohu. Casts down as well. Forget your miracle fights for Weibo. The Shy comes in. There's some big damage onto Iwandi, but it ain't enough. But now he's 1v4. And the Lightning Rat will be taken down. Pikachu no more. As, bye bye. Uh, I don't know why Chris and Light are still here. Honestly, nope. at this point, WE just cleaning house. And X and I won the picking up the final kill. I don't know how he survived through so much in this game, but WE have done it. They've pushed it to a third game. They keep themselves in this series and they take themselves one and closer to playoffs. They need this. They need Nami on the bottom side. The obvious other route is to go something like Talia here and try and slam yep. the early game. And it seems like that's exactly what we're going to get here from Weibo. Yeah, Talia locked in to go with Caster's Vi. So Caster locks him up. You go for the flick back, do the damage. Could have very easily been a go button for Caster here. As they've not necessarily found all the marks. Whilst we was panning down towards the bottom side and such. What's the point? They still want it. Oh, Casa goes in, tied a wave onto everyone as well. Look at the CC chain onto Iwandi. The polymorph is not enough. Casa somehow surviving, but in the meantime, is hung, forced away. Shanks gets oh. the kill. The Shadows dive so deep for this. And it's hope to arrive on the scene as Light was still in the bottom lane. Won't be able to finish the drop. Ult for ult in the top side. I think Bu Bu potentially just trying to force the all in so that the Shy doesn't have his ultimate and can't come and influence this play on the bottom side. Weaver's wall. Only I box I want. Can they find the kill? Dodges away from the bubble. It's not going to be enough. He goes down. But at what cost? Kaza kicks back and taking out. Hung escapes. Wow. And it's a one for one, but a jungler taken right before you. For the tower. And he certainly attempted to, but not close enough. Shall who? Oh, he's rooted. Can do they have the damage? Well, yes, 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 they do have yes, the damage. Do. My goodness. <laughs> Shanks on three kills on this rise right now. Will be that break point where they can start to be. Uh, a little more in the face of WE, but 
I mean, again, setting the pace as they are right now, it's not going to look good as the Shy being picked on as flat. But he's going to be able to use it. He's just dead. Instantly hit. It's basically a melee ult. And Weibo yeah. haven't been able to displace that just yet. They could maybe at this Herald, but I mean, the Shy. Oh, no. It's oh, got no. to get going for home, but he just doesn't have the damage. Oh, has the sustain, though. Walks away with his life for the time being the Caliper. Not quite enough. Oh, he burns. I'm not even sure what killed him at that point, but does go down. Bew Bew could be answered as well. The Weaver's Wall walks through it. What just happened? <laughs> as he gets underneath the tower, the Gale Force is enough to finish him off. Is Orn just immune to walls now? Immune. Orn is immune to a lot of things. Save it all. But Orn specializes probably in weapons that break moves. Right? Uh, as a. He's being broken right now. His armor's certainly been broken by Carson. Shanhu should be able to finish the kill off. It's a good knockup, but it's not going to be enough. The Shanks, you know, had a bit of damage onto the Shanks. Find an int. Bew Bew. <laughs> going to try and charge. Ward placed. Lani desperately wants to fight for mid prior, but there's just no way he can do it by himself. And Weibo forced out of river to contest this. Weibo, one deep. Oh, oh. So close to going down from the Gale Falls. That's flash Here we go. right now. to make it happen but at least got one hope just going absolutely super sick <laughs> absolutely crazy just gets caught out oh it's just <laughs> okay i actually think i think it's from me on, on live yeah, yeah. <laughs> kid, that's so funny but uh they still <laughs> find it with the way because graviton was there we're actually if there's one thing i've noticed about league of legends in 2023 is that oh. first damage hasn't died and no, it has but not. Hung has. <laughs> Hung has very much died. Uh, you may as well just continue your previous with, point. With, I guess, on the bright side of WE, they'll take that. Uh, they can see them all. <laughs> 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 oh, dear. I'm glad Chris went for the sweep of that. Because I oh, got real awkward, and he's walked way too close. Shanks is so tanky, though. Colin finally comes out. Hope actually tanking for his mid laner. Oh, as he charges oh. on in. Hope is so aggressive, and he's punished once again. Just diving into the enemy team is Avelios. WE, low on each one. They should just defend it really well, WE. They're going to just peel away now, because the dragon's about to be finished off, and potentially look for a fight on the back end. What do they want here? Weibo can't really pull the trigger. Shanks is gonna pull and try and find his way onto this plan. On. They take out Carson and now they're looking for more as well. Moonlight Vigil is in and it's not enough. As the Shy jumps into the fray. Shanks, Zonya's away from the bubble. As Shy has to back away again. Another... They're not willing to take the flip. They aren't willing to take the flip. Crisp with a bubble? I don't think they realized Crisp that we were actually going for it until Crisp came on in. Okay. The smite through from W. An absolute blinder in this series. And it feels like Weibo are out of sorts and are running out of answers. And unless some kind of miracle can happen in the next few minutes, it's feeling very WE favored. Carter going in onto Hung, but it's just going to be a little bit of a trade between the jumpers. For now, a lot of damage. Here we go, man. We said they need a miracle. They the guy that's been too aggressive all game long. Weaver's Wall from Shadow Uzi wants more out on Flashes away. Yu Bu slams his face into the wall as he's being chased down by Shadow. That's Hu. Spot, I think he should be able to get away. Yeah. W again is for a side red. shove. They're on like the I same cooldown tanky. too. They're on the same cooldown. I mean, we saw how hard it is for them to kill Yu Bu already. Yeah. Never mind. But Tech Soul in play. Big go, damage Shanks. coming out from Shanks onto the Shy. That's Dominus burnt already. He can back away with his phase rush, but he's locked down due to health damage. Sonyas comes out wild growth as well. They can turn a burn on the Drake here, but it's Shank still committed oh to the God. play. Big damage coming out. Burning isn't going to connect in the Shies in the fray. Weibo perhaps with an opportunity oh, to shoot. Hung goes down. Cards are charging in. I want D low on HP. And Xiaohu with a double kill. Light wants Pew Pew. He wants to get out the damage that he really needed to try and turn that fight around. You start to see it for a brief moment. But don't know. Now they know. The but it's too late. There, but it's too late. Look at it. 3,000 oh. on the Baron. is going to be taking the tidal wave used just to buy space. HP. And that's about it. He's, he's got no other tank items with HP attached to them. So even though he's got resistances, he doesn't have the health bar to deal with that. And now Weaver's Wall comes out. He's going to push yep. WE back slightly farther. 
But W, you can see they're angling for something with Shanks. They want to fight, but they don't want to overextend and lose a fight here. You lose a fight here, you lose the game. Yeah. Still a minute of Baron buff for Weibo. Just trying to use those cannons to threaten the in here. And Han goes in, but he does a bad kick. Knocked off the bubble is there as well. Cards are still going. Here we go. Han is taken down. Weibo starts to fight strong. The shine getting into the middle of everyone. Redemption comes out for WE. Oh, I want him. Taken down. I want him. As the shy gets the stun onto Shanks, still three strong for WE. They're fighting away, but it's another take down, top for top. Hope has to make a miracle happen here. Oh, the damage! The damage. Shanks is there, pushing forwards. Both of them golden, and Shanks back and away, taken down. Weibo on a knife edge, but they're winning out the fight. It's a miracle for Weibo. It looked like it was lost, but a series of miracles, in fact. Might just be enough for them to end the game. Hope trying to hold on, but the light takes him down. Accepts his own death in trade for Weibo. Finding a 10th win, getting double digits. And two of them have died? Wait a they minute. They can't end. No! <laughs> oh, it was such a good call as well. Weaver's wall up. Can you believe what? This is not important enough to contest right now. It's only sole point. So now, both. and there's been a lot of weird picks. There's been a lot of moments where people are getting caught out. Light taking you go. a chunk. Hope flashing over the wall. Look at him go. He's so aggressive. I don't know to see it. It's the shot flashing onto him. Can he finish the AD carry? That's the question. He walks away. He's following off. They're on top of him. to go down here. The support got as well. And he's taken out. Way more done it. Against everything. Against scaling. Against everything we talked about. Weibo make it happen anyway. A triple kill for the shy, and they walk, it. walk it home slowly but surely to an open nexus. And WE, it's like sand falling between your hands as the prize frankly disintegrates in front of them. And Weibo will pick up their temp series win, moving to the. But it's not.